Hi, it's Chris from Page North, and today I'm going to be talking about footage on Twitter that isn't yours. So I've got a tweet from Wimbledon at the moment. It features Simona Halep, and one of the ways that you can feature footage that isn't your own, but on your own profile, is to do a simple retweet, or you could do a quote tweet, as several people have done so already. So let's just select that and go to quote tweet. So I could put fantastic rally superb superb tennis and tweet that out so let's see how that renders and it would end up looking like that so there's a lot of clutter in there because the official Wimbledon account has already put its own caption and I think that that detracts from what you're trying to say so let's delete this. So to me, there's a better way of doing it and I'm going to show you how using the exact same footage. So if we go back to the tweet that we're focusing on, it's from the official Wimbledon Twitter account, as I've mentioned. So I'm going to scroll down. I'm going to click on this share icon. I'm going to click copy link to tweet. I'm then gonna go to my own profile. I'm gonna click on tweet. I'm going to paste that link. So I'm going to put my own caption just ahead of the link. So I'll use the same caption or similar that I used before. And I'm going to delete from this link everything up to and including the question mark. And I'm going to put a forward slash video and then a forward slash one. And if I tweet that, it will just be my caption and just the footage. So that to me is much better. It's much more neat and tidy. The focus is on my caption and the footage itself. There's not nearly as much clutter in there. So that's how to replicate somebody else's footage on Twitter if you don't want all the clutter of a quote tweet.